Okay, I have returned. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing that the Reaper can't spawn here. Final dead end should be below you. Are you ready? Yeah! Everyone's here. Is this the deepest part of the Abyss of Time? You think so? Looks the same as everywhere else to me. It would make sense, considering the path we've taken. And that means the source of the Abyss, and therefore the time loop, should be here. Oh, I almost forgot! Speaking of the Abyss, I found something in those notes about it that I mentioned earlier. You did? They said that this place came to be as a reaction to the creation of Tartarus. A reaction? Yes, because a giant tower appeared out of nowhere and ended up leaving a massive hollow in its place. That's the Abyss. So they've known about this place for ten years? They thought that it would be harmless if left alone, and that it would probably disappear when Tartarus did. But the notes also said that since the Abyss is just a byproduct of Tartarus, there shouldn't be any shadows in it. Seriously? Uh, counterpoint? There's a shitload of shadows here! <laughs> Good counterpoint, Jumpo. And if it was supposed to go poof along with Tartarus, then why are we standing in it? They forget a decimal place or something? No, their logic makes sense, but some kind of force prevented it from vanishing. So the other side's disappearance caused an imbalance. What could that force be? Who knows? Maybe it's down here somewhere, but one thing's for certain. It's deeply connected to all of you. The hell's up with that? What do we do to deserve this? Well, there's another door. If it is down here, then maybe... Got nothing else to do. So whatever's past that could be what's causing all this? If we leave out Aegis, Metis, and me, whose past is left? Yeah. Gotta be someone else with a reason for their power, right? Well, there's no point wasting time thinking about it. It's literally right there. Let's just open it. Then we'll know. Whatever the cause is, it's strong enough to keep the Abyss of Time from disappearing, and we'll be trying to destroy it. We could be in for a battle. We should make sure we're prepared for that. She's right. This is where we aim to settle everything. And I know we can do this. Make sure we are prepared. Right. Instantly walks into the door. <laughs> I... I... am... Huh? I keep forgetting this is where you, you see this. existence to it but I can't fulfill my purpose now there's nothing I can do anymore is there anything left for me to live for is there a meaning to any of it <sighs> if this is what it's like now then I I wish I could just be a simple machine again Was that was the cause? Well, don't look at me. Well, um, I was glad to be able to see him again, even if it was just from behind. And 
indeed. That was obviously Igus's memory just now. But what's it mean? I guess that was supposed to be her reason for awakening? But she already had a persona. She didn't awaken to that one. She awakened to the persona abilities that he had. I guess what was that memory? And when did it happen? <sighs> it's where I would always wake up. It was so painful losing him. I couldn't bring myself to do anything, so I just hid in my room. For a while, I did nothing but chase after him in my dreams. Oh, I guess... Sister... Eventually, I stopped having dreams at all. It felt like the weight on my chest was lightening. Until it was lifted entirely. What we saw just now... Must have been the last time I had that dream. But honestly, I don't know why that would be my reason. Sister? Are you still in pain? The person we saw in your dream. He's the one with the same power as you, isn't he? <sighs> so that's what's supposed to have caused all this? How? None of this makes sense! You still don't get it? We only saw it in my sister's memory. But all of you want to see him again, right? If that's the case, then the conclusion is simple. What are you saying? I guess what I said at the beginning was right after all. Eliminating all of you would have been the fastest way to solve this. So, that figure we keep seeing... Wait, something's wrong. What the... Just as I thought, a monster is coming. Your regrets themselves given form. Is that... No way. Are you shitting me? What the hell is this thing? It's the cause of everything. The abyss of time not disappearing. Shadows being present within it. What you see now is a being of your own creation. Still love that. Um, Komao doesn't get the exclamation point. <laughs> Um, hopefully, this isn't going to be too much of a stomp. <laughs> I'd imagine we'll be a bit overpowered for this, but... Whoops. Oh yeah, he has plenty of health. Oh, we already debilitated him. Um... Eh, why not? <laughs> Hi, counter. Not bad about damage. Not gonna lie, for some reason I was like, uh, why, why is Master's health not going down with these skills? I was looking at uh, Mitsu for some reason. <laughs> Strike to one. Dominate. I I do wonder just how much damage does this take do. Okay, similar amount. 
I wouldn't be surprised with the light boost. That would actually do more. Oh, because by default, I want to say Almighty doesn't do it as much as the elemental ones. With, you know, obvious exceptions, but... Um, I'm just going to do this to extend it. And also do some damage. <laughs> Mm. Oh, you finally hit one. Um, da -da -da -da. Thank you, sister. Close. Man, she's been nailing these quits. It's as if her luck stats like maxed or something. <laughs> it's not. That's the joke. It's almost. What's the plan here? How about the Let's see. I do wonder, like. There we go. Stop it! You can't use it. I can do this. I mean, there's one way we can finish this. <laughs> Um, I don't think Metis gets a variation. Like, she's the only one, his he won't copy their persona. That's fine. Because I'm not planning on killing him yet. I want to see him switch to the twos. Gonna just like stall for time. <laughs> I might put um you call it? the skill that reduces healing on what's his face? Just to make salvation a bit more cheaper. I guess the one thing we could do to try and max damage as well is to then also get him on the ground, but... Damage inflicted! Artemisia too? Hmm. Expecting a bit more, but okay. <laughs> I'm interested to see like what the other all the other characters have to say. But that's another time. Flop. Game over. <laughs> I 
must there have been a moan there. <laughs> I'm already saying, like, if you've seen the original version of this scene, you know how traumatizing the other version of this is. <laughs> I think that's the biggest issue, like, with reloading in terms of, like, story presentation. Don't get me wrong. Really impressive stuff, but it just doesn't have the same oomph or the same vibe. Like holy hell, the original version of that. That was a monster of our own creation. But that was. Don't worry, Yukari. It may have taken his form, but that was a shadow. At least, it seemed like one to me. Wait, how does that make sense? It was used in Personas! Personas are supposed to be used to fight shadows, right? Wait, so you don't know? Personas and shadows are the same thing. That's why you're able to fight them in the first place. Shadows are the basis components of the human mind. Suppressed thoughts given physical form. I there's as someone whose Persona 3 was their first game, hearing all this blew my mind, but it fits with, you know, everything else that came before and after. When people lose <laughs> the strength to face the darkest parts of themselves, those parts break loose, free from all control. But in rare cases, people with a certain awareness are able to consciously tame their shadows. That's all it is. So, Persona users are just people who can control their own shadows? Wait, back up a sec. So, Personas and Shadows are just different names for the same thing? How didn't you know? Wouldn't whoever created me and my sister had to have known that? No one involved with that is still alive. <laughs> so then, our personas were the cause of all this? The power of shadows affects both time and space, so it makes sense that your subconscious thoughts would be manifested through your personas. You can't accept time moving on. You don't want to admit that you live in a present where you've lost someone precious. So that's... that's why it looked like him. Time stopped. Just like we wanted. And now we're stuck here with our memories. We're the ones who trapped ourselves. <sighs> How ironic. Well, regardless of what it was, we beat that thing. <laughs> <laughs> we understand our regrets. So shouldn't we be able to leave now? Yes. Whoa! What the hell's this now? Looks like a key. Those must be the keys that will allow you to leave. They're all glowy. Once you make it outside, the abyss of time should disappear on its own. But, um, why are there eight of them? Because you all had a hand in causing this. These keys can be likened to the power of your hearts. The door should open if you use all eight at once. Strength of heart when united is barred by no door. Is this what he meant? So we just put them all together and we're good? Cool. Then let's get the hell out of here. Oh, wait. Uh, these are for the dorm entrance, right? There is that. But it's not your only option. There's another door as well. One that doesn't lead to the outside world. You can exit through it, or the entrance. Those are your choices. A door that doesn't lead outside. So the one to his room, why the choice? The entrance will return you to the present, but the other door leads to the past. 
The past. Komo has no idea what's going on and he doesn't care. The world of the past. You've all been there many times now, but this time, the abyss will disappear if you go through that door. You'll actually be in the past. What? Are you being straight with us? Why would I lie? I'm just telling you what I know. Let me see if I understand correctly. We have to choose between moving forward past our regrets or revisiting the source of them. What do you want to do? Me? I'll go along with whatever you decide, sister. I just... want to save you from this awful fate. That's all I care about. Awful fate? So what will you choose? I... <sighs> Hey, uh, why don't we go back to the dorm first? This is way too heavy to decide right here. Yes, I agree. It makes sense why she wants to kill them all. <laughs> Without What's them, going on? they would have been, uh, the doors would have just opened. What the hell are these cracks in the floor? bad. It's becoming unstable. We still have time, but not much. If these fissures reach the door, we might not be able to leave, even with the keys. It's just one thing after another, isn't it? So, uh, guess we gotta decide what to do with these keys, huh? <sighs> um, well... I want to stay in the present. I think that's what he would have wanted, too. What he would have wanted, huh? I've been thinking. He died so suddenly, and they never even figured out the cause. I get the feeling that he... He must have given his life to make some kind of miracle happen. He thought about it, weighed his options, and ultimately chose to leave this world to us. Hi. Miracle? That's why, personally, I don't want to just undo his decision. I want to respect his sacrifice. Uh, Amada-kun. I'm with Amada. We all saw the resolve it takes to face death head on and accept it. That resolve? what it brought about. Even if it hurts, we have to accept it too. That's how we honor his memory. Yukari, what about you? You're all about the here and now, right, Yukatan? You gotta look forward, huh? That's practically your motto, ain't it? I... I want to go back. Yeah, I always tell myself to look forward and let go of the past, but this is different. We might be able to change something. We can't pass that up. Yukari. So you take away his choice for your own. That's not what I said. We can actually change the past. What's wrong with wanting that? And let me ask you, if you prevented your father's death, what would happen? The people you've met, what you've gone through with them, it'd all be gone. And you wouldn't be the person you are now. It's the same for Shinji and Miki. I wouldn't erase their deaths either. Every single thing about my past is important. Because it all shaped who I am. Guys, guys, let's all take it down a notch, okay? Take it down a notch? Are you kidding? If anything, we're not taking this seriously enough. We can save him from dying. Don't you want to bring him back? Of course I want him back. But is yelling at each other like this really gonna solve anything? And 
think about it. If we go back, we'd have to face Nyx again. What? So you're just afraid to fight? No! I... Well, I am, but... Uh, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but everyone needs to calm down, all right? I just son, how do you think we should use the keys? I am the past or the present? I'm just not sure. You seriously won't make a choice? The day we said our goodbyes, you were the only one who didn't show up. You got to hear his last words, and now you even have his power. But you still don't know how you feel about him? Listen, I know it hurts. Believe me. It hurts so much I can't stand it. But... Yukari-san, I... Forget it. Nothing I say will make a difference anyway. Metis, does everyone have to agree for the keys to combine? Not necessarily. The keys themselves don't have opinions. So in other words, it's possible to take them by force and combine them. By force? Are you saying you want to fight? I don't want to. But if we can't agree, we don't have a choice. We're running out of time. And talking hasn't gotten us anywhere. You have a point. This matter concerns the life of a dear friend. I doubt any of us will be easily swayed. So in that case... Boy, Harijo-senpai? I had already made my decision. I will stand with Yukari. Senpai! They're siding with Takeba. Are you sure? All right. I guess you've got your reasons. And I've got mine. Well, I'm sticking with my sister. I'll protect her no matter what. That makes sense, Metis. You know what's important to you. So you understand why I can't back down either, right? Yes. Everyone, wait! Don't do this! I made my feelings clear. Now you... No. Now everyone needs to recognize their own feelings. Think about who he was. And what he meant to us. We'll need a proper venue for the battles. A place where the results will be absolute. I'll show you the way. Let me know when you're ready. Really? Going to fight each other? My friends are incredibly divided. Inconceivably, even. What decision will I come to myself? I do think that was handled a bit better than the original, but I still get the feeling in the original as well. I, I guess the biggest difference is they toned you carry down a bit. I think... I count on you for a lot of things, I guess, and I understand it's hard to make a decision. But if I side with you on this, then the others, I just don't know what to do. Well, I... Just as I said earlier, I'll be joining you carry in this fight. I'm sorry it turned out this way. I know it's uh, irresponsible me to choose sides after appointing you as our leader. But I won't budge on this. That's why there's no need for you to hold back. Come at us with everything you have. That's... I'm not trying to say I'm objectively right here or anything, but we don't have enough time to keep arguing. I just, towards the end of our fight with Nyx, I couldn't even move. All I could do was watch as he left us. So I want to go back and leave no regrets this time. I mean, facing our regrets was the whole point of this, right? Do you need to come to a decision too? I won't accept this... Uh, I won't accept that you just don't have any opinions about this. Sorry, I just felt the need to stand in the middle there. I, I don't know if I can really explain this, but I don't think anyone's right here. I mean, even you don't know what to do here, right, I guess? Sorry. 
That also doesn't sit well with me. That's why I can't take your side. She said to think about how we feel, so I'm just going to do just that. Pan pan. Komasan is looking over at Junpei san. Seems that he's chosen a partner to side with. I think. I understand why someone would want to change the past, how desperate they might be for the chance to do so. But would it be meddling with the past for him or for our own sake? Because he wasn't the victim of some man random accident, he chose well, us. That's why I won't change the past, I'll never agree to it. Well, I... To be honest, I miss him a lot too. It's not like I don't want him to come back, but he made his choice and I want to try and understand his decision. Think... That's why I'll be signing with Sanada-san on this, he feels the same way as I do. I'm low-key surprised that let's just go upstairs. <laughs> oh no, it's our star. I, I'm going to assume everything's the same. I don't know why I feel the need to run around. But I do. Okay. <laughs> now that we stretched our legs, let's move on. Excuse me. I just don't understand what's going through everyone's head. Please don't let that get to you, though, sister. I'll protect you in their place, no matter what. Once we leave, we're all going to be split up, and uh, you won't be able to see your friends after this. Are you ready? Slash. Make sure you have equipment from them that you need. Sister. But we're fine. Okay. Follow me then. So this is... Where is everyone else? Don't worry about them. They're just waiting in their own areas. You see the big door up ahead? There's an arena through there. That's where we'll be fighting them. And these are real battles. There will be a price for losing. <sighs> Sister, are you listening? Is there really no other way? It seems so. The others didn't appear willing to back down anyway. But even if you refuse to fight, I won't let them take your key. You promised me that you wouldn't hurt my friends! I know. But your life might be on the line here. What? Your key and your new power are both deeply connected to your heart. So, if your key is taken, I think your life could be at risk. But you don't know for sure! No, but it's possible, isn't it? The other person with the same power as you died, didn't he? I'll... I'll protect my sister, whatever it takes. You know, this is actually where I woke up. I've been wondering what this place is, but now I have this feeling. It's hard to explain, but I think this is what I was meant to do all along. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, another fun fact. Had you... <laughs> had you not leveled up Metis... Uh, and got I know to this, this point. Whole matter is complicated, but I'm still with you. I'll do whatever I can for you. Without leveling up matters, then you you will have to. Well, do this point without met uh, with uh, a low level matters. I'm just curious what happens if you go back. Oh, Elizabeth is here. Good day. Marvelous. Uh, do you possess the power to overcome adversary? 
any adversary as well, just as he did. Seems all I can do is watch over you from here, so please do journey with caution. Oh my! Uh. Very well. Oh, Fuku is here. Hello. What? A new door, and it'll take us to where we'll be fighting. What do I do? Okay. go through the door, I'll end up fighting my friends. This. This is where you woke up? I like how the door opening is just a light texture in front of it. Huh. Why the setup here? And perfectly fitting if you ask me. I guess Sonata Senpai! Fukasan? She will be providing support to both sides equally. Is that acceptable? Wait, you can't just decide that for me! I won't help my friends hurt each other! But with your ability... Yamagishi, go with Igis. If you're wholly against the idea of us fighting, then you shouldn't be on our side. But... Sonata-senpai... Amana and I know what we want. And we're ready to fight for it. <laughs> igis son. <laughs> Have you decided what you'll do if you get the keys? I am so gearing up to readily punch you in the face, Fuka, so go over there so then I can do it. <laughs> I... I can't fight my friends. Takebo was right. We need to recognize our feelings. Sounds like you still don't. If you don't have anything to fight for, just hand over your key. Walk away. But no, I won't allow it. Hmm. 